now we are going to dispatch our course so for that we come into our course that is now in our library and here there is dispatches for this course there are no dispatches at the moment but we just create one that's true we need to create like a tag to find organize let's say our dispatches I'm gonna put for LMS okay and I'm going to create oops I forgot to create the destination name LMS save so the destination will be for my LMS click on create and here's my course so what I'll do is I'm going to download my dispatch file I go into downloads and here is my dispatch I'm gonna put it here just to see everything together so here is my original oh here is my original scrum file that i have loaded into scrum cloud and here is the dispatch one which is basically a normal scrum file that is going to link to the original scrum that is in, that is located in a scrum cloud so one important utility of this is for example some LMSs won't take really long SCORM files so if your file is really big like let's say 100 megs and your, your LMS is not gonna take it uh, because of this uh, big size problem then you just load here in SCORM cloud you create a dispatch and then this is small SCORM that you have created and you download it is the one that you're going to put in your normal LMS when someone launches the course from your normal LMS that file that SCORM is going to redirect the learner to open the original file and the course will run perfectly fine with it without any issues so I hope this was clear and so cool